What up, what up? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to watch free Muay Thai fights, which are available every Sunday in Bangkok at the Channel 7 Boxing Stadium. You need to go to the Channel 7 studio. They start at 2.30. You have to wear a collar shirt, closed shoes, and long pants, which I'm missing. So either buy long pants, or there's people that rent collar shirts and long pants outside, like near, the, near the, um, the studio. So we're gonna get there right now, hopefully get there in time. Like I said, starts at 2.30, but since it's free, you do need to get there early to line up and get in and make sure you're in before it gets full. Uh, so hopefully we make it there by then. If not, then this video probably isn't going to go up anyway, but let's go. All right, I have a little bit. That's the proper mud tasting stuff. <laughs> oh, all right, let's go. I need a beer. Leo. <laughs> <laughs> he also said he didn't sleep last night either because he's been working on the motorbike all night so this should be fun all right well we've made it there's a stadium over there just over here where the long pants were no way i'm not i'm not i'm no i'm not renting a pair of elephant pants to wear in there that is not happening there has to be someone else selling pants. No. No. I bet you some of us is watching this are cracking up right now. Well, there's more down here. I'm not wearing elephant pants in there, bro. Come on. No. Surely someone's got jeans. Oh. There we go. Right, some normal pants. Oh, no. Yeah. Big ones, huh? Oh. Big? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'll try, I'll try. Can I try? Yeah. Just here? All right. Yeah. Perfect. Stand in the corner and get your kid off. How are we looking? <laughs> the outfit's not really going together right now, but who cares? It's also stinking hot. All right, let's see. I think it's 50, around 50 deposit, mate. Yeah. Oh, no, see ya. All right. Looking like an absolute idiot but now we fit the criteria so that's all that matters i really should have bought some jeans when i seen him at those markets the other day eh? and i hope the aircon in is good still got about 20 minutes or so to everything starts so i want to try and get a i don't know if they have beer in there so i'm going to try and grab a quick oh there's a 7-eleven right in i'll grab a quick leo from here smash it down head in never mind there's a little independent one here i'll do that instead always try and stop into one of these shops before a eh? 7-eleven especially i'm just grabbing like a few drinks or something like that even just like soap or laundry detergent that sort of thing if there's one of them nearby I'd stop in there instead of 7-eleven no worries Daniel. cheers here yeah, people heading in hopefully they're still from the video that i seen bro it goes crazy with the gambling in here because gambling in thailand is illegal but there's an exemption for for muay thai so apparently there's like little hand signals that they do in here like meaning i want the red corner and the blue and also the amount they want to bet so it should be pretty interesting i'm keen to get involved all right we're going in thank you thankfully i didn't end up like that i was stressing there and i seen them pants was the only option for a little bit ready brother Watch a couple of knockouts. Oh no. 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 No, they've, they've closed the gate. If they're full now and I've been standing there the whole time just drinking, bro. Not, not just drinking, but you know, just, no. That's, that's gonna suck. I'll let everybody in. Oh yeah, there we go. Starting to smell that uh, that boxing liniment. That's when you know you're in the right zone. Oh, aircon's good. Aircon's good. View is not. Oh, okay, so this is why you get in here early. Like you need to get here super early if you want to be sitting, bro. Look, they're sitting over there, there, and up here. That's it. No bar, nothing in here, man. 
Yeah. <laughs> Back in the cloud nine basement, bro. I get why they're free, man. I'm almost bum on this bloke, to be honest. I mean, the game was solid. Yeah, look, look. He's holding up a thousand. On who? A couple of young blokes in this one. I quit. <laughs> but yeah, that's gonna that's even though the aircon was on, yeah, I was starting to get hot. You could you could see it's yeah, it wasn't the best situation, so uh, I'm not saying don't do it if you're here on a holiday. Definitely do it. Just don't get here as late as I did. So that's all on me. Uh, I'm gonna. Ma I'm just still gonna upload this video. I'm just. I'm just gonna make sure that in the future, um, if I'm in Bangkok for a Sunday, I'm gonna get here at about one o'clock and get inside at one o'clock, so I can have one of them, uh, one of the seated seats in an actual decent spot. But like I say, we live and learn, and gives me a reason to come back. So it's not all. Uh, it's not all bad. So now to go change these hot pants into back into my shorts and figure out what to do for the rest of the afternoon because this was going to be it now <laughs> now i'm really winging it oh so hot <laughs> man oh. and like this like this huh? <laughs> <laughs> all righty we figured out what we're going to do we're going to go for a ride on one of the long tail boats i don't think it's going to be one of the big like turbo diesel ones but one of the loud ones anyway with the car motor on the back of it i was sitting here stressing i was like, looking at night markets thinking what do i do what do i do for the video and he was like oh the boats and i was like yes sir let's go so we've got something to do that's that's the main thing i'm getting another beer i'm excited now one more leo <laughs> When he, when he said five minutes, it's five minutes to we're leaving, not five minutes to get there. It's 41 minutes. <clears throat> Probably about 20 with this bloke driving. <laughs> They're still there waiting like a bunch of idiots, man. I even told one of them it's a waste of time. Trust me, I went in there, I left, I showed him a video of what it's like, and he was like, oh. And then they were still waiting. Yeah, enjoy, man, enjoy. Made it down to, I know you can't really see it, but the water's literally just here. He told me just before, he goes, let me go down and talk to him, work out a price, and then you come down. Because if they see me first, the price will be higher. And I was like, you're a legend. So, <laughs> I don't know, I don't know if we're gonna get on and go somewhere, or if we get on just here. Here we go, made it down to the pier. Oh, yeah. uh, no speed boats, I'm sure we're gonna have to jump on one of these and get to where they're at or something, I don't know. He's the expert, we'll figure it out. We're about to see, I suppose. We have to sit and wait for the boat. Oh, okay, it hasn't come yet. Alright, no worries. 
สวัสดีครับImagine what those ones with the turbo oh, diesel are like, man. <laughs> Whoa. Quick little razz on the boat. I mean, sounds good to it. The straight pipe. I don't know what Toyota engine that is. Four cylinder or some kind. Red Bull, but it's a bit far. That's right. Motorcycle, going on. Okay, all right. So I think what's happening, I think if, if everything's going through with translation correctly, that guy that just took us on that boat, I think he has a bigger boat that has a, like a big turbo one, and he's he's racing it tonight. Apparently, there's some boat races on tonight, and he's taking me. That's what's happening. So he said they're a bit far away, but whatever. I'm in. Sign me up. Since the since the boxing was a bit of a fail today, my fault. I mean, I'm trying I'm trying to pick this up, and we're we're going pretty good. I mean, that was fun. Now we've got word of some races. You know what I mean? I don't know about the legality of it, but we're going. I wasn't sure if we're going to be going to watch these boat races tonight, but we're going right now. And it said uh, 40 minutes on the map. We're walking back around to the bike, ring, flying out there. 40 minute trip. So about about 25 with old mate, <laughs> old mate riding. Quick pit stop for some petty, bro. Okay, <laughs> got to keep putting the air in because my bloody fat bum probably pushing all the air out.
Jag är bara för att mig. Flöj. Så man, är du? Kan vi watch some boats, bro? I am the only white bloke here right now. We're like, oh, look at this, bro. I didn't even realize this massive one across here. Look at it.
little watch. At least I know where to, like, exactly where to come now, so that's good. Uh, for now, I'm not really sure. Mate, I'll get something to eat for this video. A couple of bevies, mate. Oh, no, I'll figure it out. But, I mean, it's been pretty good. After a failed start with the boxing, I think we've made up for it quite well. We pulled up here at whatever this place is. Another little Thai barbecue situation. So, go in here, smash down a little bit of that. What I am keen for after it's open, look at this. Oh. I need to punish some water and I could really, I really could do with a chalky shake right now. Right, I'm in the mood for it. Hopefully the food doesn't change that. Just next to him is this noodle place, this one. Oh, the soup place. Soup be smelling good. I can smell the broth from here. It smells really good. All right, so I don't really know what's going on. I thought this isn't one of the ones where you're like, but the other one that I went to, you just, they bring out a menu. It has different sized platters and stuff on it. And that's the way I usually do it. I just pick the platter that I want. Other ones have like a, um, I like all you can eat. This one though, I think I think you pay and then you have to get a kilo. They give you like you go get a bowl and there's a massive freezer up there or fridge whatever with heaps of meats and seafood and stuff in it. And I think you just need to make it a kilo and then that's only that's 200, 249 bucks for a kilo of meats. We out here submerging our meat. <laughs> Get out of it. At some point, hang on. Ah. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, at some point, I know one of you has got a message me on Instagram <laughs> doing the same thing somewhere in somewhere in Thailand. You finally get over here for your holiday. You get to one of these sort of Thai barbecue situations. I want a couple of videos sent to me of just you know join the submerged meat crew. <laughs> I'm reluctantly gonna have to call it. I'm somehow so full. The last thing I ate was like Subway, like a foot long subway, like eight o'clock this morning. It's uh, 8.23. First thing I've eaten in like 12 hours, I'm, I'm somehow I'm full, so. I've still got, I know it's not like me, but can't help it, bro. I don't even know if I fit in that chocolate shake, bro. Or if they're open anymore, because uh, it started absolutely bucketing down out there. Oh, it's lightning now. All oh, right, finished up. Ended up being, it was 2.96 baht, which is what it was. I mean, for two people to have a mad feed. I, I didn't have any alcohol, I was just a big bottle of water. Still, that's, that's very good. Let me see if this place is open. I'm only a couple minutes from home. And it's like, ah, oh, let me see if I can get a chalky thick shake. I'll try, let's have a look. Oh, they're closed. Bloody hell, oh well. So we have a shot. Uh, that's gonna do for this video, actually. So yeah, started off a bit rough, but I, th I think we I think we recovered well. Uh, either way, even though we didn't get to see all the Muay Thai fights there, you at least you know how to watch some free ones now. I'm gonna do another video on that at some point. Also, finally got to see some of the race boats, got to go on one, um, and now I know where to go to ride on one of the bigger ones as well in, for the future, so that's nice. Either way, I've done a couple of things that I really wanted to do. Ended up ticking them off my sort of bucket list. I'm happy with that. I'm going to finish the video here. Cheers for coming along on the adventure. Cheers for watching. I'll catch you on the next one. See ya.